Hey everyone, hope you guys are enjoying your Sunday. I'm about to go look at um, the third extra booster out of the series so far called the Extra Booster 3 Ultra Rare Miracle Collection. This, okay, you don't really have a good picture here, but it's featuring Suiko, Corin, and Rekka, the Tatsunagi girls. And behind them, I don't know the name of the angel feather. I mean, well, I'm about to find out right now, but I can name the two. You have White Lily Musketeer, I think that's her name, uh, Cecilia, and we have Incandescent Lion Blonde Ezel. So, going on to the release date, it's, as you can see, it's, a, it's release is going to be around in Japan. October 19th this year. So we might probably get like a month or two after. And the concept of the set, and I will read, includes 66, um, 66 cards, 3 VRs, 6 triple rares, 9 double rares, 15 rares, and 33 commons, plus 9 parallel cards, 3 SVRs, the new ultra rare rare, I was going to get some taken used to. And we have three Origin Rares. Plus three SCRs. Each display, each display includes one VR and, or one SVR or one OR. Introduces the new Ultra Rare URR. I'm still having trouble saying that. Each display includes 12 packs, and each card includes 24 displays. Each pack includes 7 cards, 2 of them, being R or greater. Includes support for Angel Feather, Gold Paladin, and Neo Nectar Clans. Uh-huh. The URRs are signed... I don't really think that's important. They're signed by their voice actors, just to speed it up. Okay. The only cards that are actually confirmed is Solidify Celestial Zarekiel, Incandescent Lion Blonde Ezel, and White Lily Musketeer Cecilia. Oh, I got the other two right. Okay, so here's what I also will explain. It's also to what gifts they have for whose people that don't know. Angel Feather gets Protect. Gold Paladin gets Excel. I'm pretty sure that Ezel Senpai is going to be happy about this one. Either way, he was right. And Neo Nectar will be getting Force. So. I guess I see why they kind of gave them those gifts. I kind of, I mean, I guess it kind of would have been kind of repetitive, or I mean, repetitive that Gold Paladin would have been forced, so they're just changing it up a bit. So, another thing about it is, I like the fact that this kind of gives more, at least for Gold Paladins, that kind of gives them more of a thing in premium. Um, for those who haven't watched it, I may actually link it in the description below. I made a video about will Ezel return. And I made like a bit of a combo list. Like I said, I'm going to link it on the bottom of the description. So you guys can go check it out and you'll see what I mean. So that way you might have an idea about what combos you can use. But that's all for now. Hope you guys enjoy your day. Like, share, comment, subscribe. And see you guys later until my next video.